I know I look like absolute crap at the moment and that's because I've had probably the worst week of my life as far as health goes. I am waiting for a diagnosis. I'm seeing the doctor next week again. Um, but I'm thinking that it's possibly POTS that is wrong with me, which is postural orthostatic tachycardia. So I am having really dizzy episodes. Um, it's sometimes to do with digestion, sometimes it's not, sometimes it just happens on its own. I'm having massive heart palpitation episodes that actually end up hurting my chest because the heart is racing and pumping so hard. I am tired constantly, I can't concentrate, I haven't been able to study much at all uh, last week because of this. It's really starting to affect my quality of life now. It hasn't really much in the past. I have had fainting episodes in the past though and dizzy and looking pale and horrible and <laughs> all the rest of it. Um, and I actually gave up the other day. I've never done this before and used the wheelchair um, when I went out because I was feeling way too dizzy when I stood up. Even when I was sitting down, I was dizzy, but it was worse standing up. So I actually opted to use the wheelchair when I didn't break anything. So here's some of my symptom log that's kind of the most recent. It goes on and on and on and on for months um, on blood pressure readings and all that kind of stuff. So enjoy this interesting episode and I will let you know what happens next Tuesday. The doctor I had before was not very interested and not very... Um, he didn't offer any solutions or anything. He just said to come back when I was fainting and I was already at that point. So, <laughs> I don't know. can see that's been going on for a while um, <clears throat> by that little symptom log that I've been keeping. I've actually been keeping it since 2022, I think, but have been experiencing some odd things that didn't quite line up with osteopetrosis since I was about eight years old and had a virus that actually made me pass out on the toilet, mind you. <laughs> Um, so that's really it for now. I have realized that my swallowing, um, issue may also be related to this and not osteopetrosis as it's kind of intermittent. It doesn't happen all the time. It's just happens whenever it feels like it, usually when I'm stressed or have some inflammation going on or sick or something. I won't be able to swallow and that's actually one of the symptoms of POTS. It's called dysphagia and it basically means that the swallow is just not happening <laughs> and so when that happens I can't eat anything. It's even a struggle to sort of sip on soups and even get water down but I do force that down obviously to stay hydrated but it's difficult. And apparently that is one of the symptoms of this POTS um, syndrome. So we'll see what happens on Tuesday, but just wanted to let you know that I haven't gone missing or anything. I am still around. <laughs> I just had a pretty terrible week and um, yeah, that's basically what's going on. So catch you soon.